Uh, we've got a news alert on OpenAI. Steve Kovac. Steve, is this another 12 days of whatever? <laughs> a 12 days of shit miss. So Thank merry you. shit miss to you, Kelly. And this is coming from OpenAI. Uh, they just released Sora. This is the highly anticipated video generation tool that OpenAI teased a number of months ago. And it's been uh, really curious about when this thing was actually going to launch. It was only for beta testers. What it lets you do, Kelly, is you give it a brief prompt. We're so used to image generation these days with artificial intelligence. Well, this could do a short video clip. It's an animated clip, 3D animation. Looks kind of like, almost like a Pixar movie. Here's an example of some pirate ships floating around a coffee cup. I mean, there's there's innovation right there for you. Uh, but this is, uh, again, part of a longer tale of what uh, OpenAI has been going through. They're calling it the 12 days of shit miss. Every day, this is the third day of it, uh, that they're going to have a new product to show off. By the way, another uh, OpenAI product I want to talk about that we were expecting to launch today, that's ChatGPT on the iPhone. Uh, it was supposed to come out or is expected to come out as soon as today, but they just put out, uh, they meaning Apple, put out another uh, beta release. So it's unclear if it's going to happen today or tomorrow, but it's still going to be a very big week for OpenAI, just opening it up to tens of millions of users on the iPhone and then this really buzzy uh, Sora product for video, Kelly. Steve, one more time, just what, what did you say that we thought we were going to get this update from Apple yeah, uh, this, as it regards to This yeah. would have been the iOS update that brings ChatGPT to the iPhone, which was announced mm, back yeah. in June, and we've been expecting it. We expected it to come today at around 1 o'clock. Hasn't happened yet. In fact, they just put out another version of the beta software that's been tested, so that gives me an indication it's probably not happening today, maybe tomorrow, the next day. But uh, I reached out to Apple, asked them for some clarification on that one. That's interesting. I'm going to check on Apple shares as well, see if they're moving on that. Um, but, you know, it's a big stock. Yeah. Steve, thanks for thanks. now.